That's Thank right. You. Oh, hello. We back and we back. What else you got? It's just, I'm so yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, and folks, hello and podcast. welcome. You know us. You know how we, we do. Kind of a big deal. We made it another week. We are back. Another anchovy. In your life. That's right. All of your lives. We're still you know living, what I folks. Did this <coughs> weekend. What did you speaking, do? Speaking of Sundays, uh, last weekend I slept. I slept all weekend. It's Can like the exact that? opposite of what we did. Yes, it was. It was that. the exact opposite of what you I did. I do love that. I slept all damn day, and it was love a sleep feast. I mm. enjoyed every minute of it. Yeah. It was like I got up really late on Saturday, and then I took a three-hour nap. <laughs> Damn. Uh, yeah. Was it before and after? I crazy. usually I sleep late, wake up, breakfast, food right away. Maybe a brunch, maybe a sandwich situation. Yeah. I don't know, but I need food. Get in my belly. Then, then that creates more sleepiness, mm. hence nap. Then wake up. More food because yeah, oh my god, I haven't eaten all day. <laughs> right, exactly. That is exactly what happened. <clears throat> um, nice. I woke up late, had some food, but then I smoked, and Ooh. I was like, I'm just gonna lay down, and then that turned into a three hour nap. Yeah, it did. And uh, and that's I, nice. And right then there. when I got back up, I I smoked again. It's nice. It was, it was a very sleepy ass. <sighs> Smoking every day. I haven't, I, love I that. haven't done that. Haven't done that in a while. So, yeah. so I just nice. blew nice. away my free days by sleeping. I know it does suck. Like I do feel <sighs> like that was trash nothing. Monday, I'm like fuck. Yeah. Now I'm all behind. <coughs> <coughs> um. Yeah, that's basically what happened. I typically only do that if like I have a bender. Wishes never. Oh, I like, you're such a good boy. If it's like two, three, if I go like two days of just like <laughs> fucking let's party, yeah, Sunday is a lazy ass day for me if that's the case. But typically, my form of sleeping in these days is seven, seven thirty. Uh, it's so super late. that's like another Boom. two hours. Yeah, it has not been good, uh, <laughs> but it has been productive because I typically work on but shit. Then you when get I wake up, up, go to brunch, have a beer, drink some Ain't mimosas, time for that. get full. I gotta wait on her I to get her. up. Why not? I gotta wait on her to get up, homie. Yeah, I'm sleeping. And she's sleeping. Brunch goes to like three. Seven exactly, but I wake up at seven. So like what yeah, you you're saying up, you right have now, like three hours to yourself. Yeah, and it's nice. Exactly. And then I get up, and I usually am like, "Okay, me time." Yeah. And I'm like, "Hey, I'm up, but we're doing our own things now." Yeah. Then a couple hours later, time for brunch. We text each other bacon and eggs from the other rooms, and then we go meet at the brunch spot. We don't meet at the brunch spot. <laughs> We meet here we in our separate. fucking <laughs> house. Brunch, you so mean your kitchen? <laughs> Sometimes it's our kitchen, but usually, if I, oh. if, if like I'm gonna cook, she just stays in the living room. You guys, okay, Eric, don't be offended because I know you're gonna want to cook every single meal for us in Chicago, okay? But um, uh oh, <laughs> Michael does have a specialty in two areas for breakfast. <laughs> He's probably for sure going to do one, but the second one is a staple that we do almost every Saturday if we don't do brunch. And lately we've been trying not to because we're like, ooh. Spending a lot of money on brunch. Um, <laughs> it's an egg scramble, egg potato scramble, fucking delicious. It's not just potatoes. Well, okay. Ooh. It's an egg scramble. There's potatoes. There's a bunch of veggies in it. There's cheese. It's fucking delectable. We have bacon. I throw bacon in it. Yeah. It's fucking good. And then his other it's specialty, easy. which I think we discussed previously, is 
the B and G's, the biscuits and gravies. B and G's. Uh, just a classic. Biscuits and gravy. Another real I staple. Can't wait. And I gotta tell you, this past weekend, um, the best batch I've had. The best batch I've had from him. Well, Michael is <laughs> gearing up. Michael is getting practicing. ready. He's gearing up for, <coughs> for um, Chicago. So yeah, I had to get a practice run in. Breakfast. I'm gonna have to. Yeah, I'm gonna have to wake up early. Is that what you're saying? Oh God, no. I know. No. Be toasty for you. I'll wait. We don't. We don't start cooking till like nine, unless everyone's. It's like here. nine, somewhere between nine and eleven. Kind of depending on when she wakes yeah, up. Yeah, but Chicago and when... time, that's what? Jess. It's still nine. I'm an insomniac. Time doesn't matter to me. <laughs> the nine o'clock you see on the clock is what we're going with. Whatever time zone. Also, know. Chicago's only an hour back. Oh, is it? Okay. Yeah. Well, we should be fine. Okay, great. Well, but even like when we go to well, Indiana, hour work for you. Are, yeah. Yeah. Are we doing? Uh, um, that's what I meant. Are we doing three? Okay, we got three options. One, cook everything at the house. Two, eat out for every meal. Three, a mix of both. That's what I thought we were doing was a mix. Number three. Yeah, I would like to do both. a mix of both. Okay, so like I really think. Them. I really think breakfast can be made every day. Like you can make breakfast. I wouldn't mind finding a brunch oh, spot on like one on like Sunday no. or something. I have been sending yeah. you video after okay. video of all the hot spots. That's the right. And crannies of Chicago. In Chicago. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying we have to hit them all. It's but... too much for my brain to try to remember that right now. That's fine. I'm just saying. Remember all those. We, we have will documentation. Have to go out for a brunch. Like we have to do brunch breakfast. At least one day. At least once. I agree with that. I yeah. wouldn't mind doing. I wouldn't mind doing brunch on Sunday after church. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Good luck with that. Um. <laughs> I'll have, I'll have second kidding. brunch. So we could do brunch on 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 sa- uh, Sunday. That sounds perfect to me. Although, okay, it's probably a brunch town, and so Sundays are probably popping, so maybe we want to do a different day. Ooh. Which would probably best be, be Friday. Too. Friday could be Friday legit. might be the best. Just get Friday up. Be I feel like me. brunch specific menus are just Saturday, Sunday. Right. Well, True. okay. Sometimes. Not always, but yes. But that is a fair point. We can look. We'll look around. We'll see what's going on. And, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see what's up for that Friday or Saturday or Sunday. It doesn't matter. We can just pick a day. All right. Well, I'll tell if you, you guys know any places, leave them in the comments. We'll yeah. Yeah. Let us know what's I am up. I'm not the best Aww, cook, Eric. I like it. So Eric and Michael and perhaps I'm not Jess... really good either, but I could try. Okay, Eric and Michael sounds like y'all are in the kitchen as it should be. That's right. <laughs> and uh, anything else? Do you guys drink out? coffee? Get breakfast cook God, every morning. Yes. Yeah, I drink. Oh coffee. my God! What are I your morning down habits? Pot. Do you do you drink coffee? Black coffee, okay, dark great, roast. Because like the last couple of times I've gone on vacation, people have not been coffee people, and like I lose my damn mind. So I'm like, gonna I bring coffee, to coffee for people. sure. Oh, it sounds or like we're gonna some. need a lot of coffee. Yeah. We're gonna need coffee, coffee. for sure. Uh, the whole thing. We have an yeah, espresso like, machine now. I don't know if you guys know this. One coffee maker. Nespresso. Yes. Yeah. It's the Is that brand. What you said? No, I said wow. espresso, but that is the brand, Holy correct? Shit. That's it's fancy. It's so good. It's so good. Yeah, we're fancy. I got it for Christmas, and best thing I've gotten in a really long time. Sixty percent of the time, it works <laughs> every time. I'm really you obsessed. Know, now I, it's kind of. I was expensive. actually gonna buy myself a yeah. You're gonna buy what? 
I yeah, I was gonna buy myself a Keurig, but I was like, do I want to save up and buy the Nespresso? I think so yes. You guys like drink coffee for the taste. I drink yeah, it for sure. all reasons. Anyway. I drink it for all reasons as well. I like I like the taste of coffee. Um, the thing about the Nespresso is it I has the foaminess it, of a latte. But I mostly drink it out Ooh. of necessity. I'm with you, Eric. I do drink it out of necessity. Like, I'm not a coffee I snob it, I'm cranky. Yes, but I'm not a coffee snob. Like, we drink I'm Folgers not. on the reg. Like, that's what we get because it's cheap. Oh, my God. And I, I have now no... Now I'm judging you. Ugh. Yeah, I have, I have no problem with it. I'm not a snob Folgers, in any what way. Is this, prison? <laughs> I'm telling you, though, my if it's dark roast, I'm fine. The minute it's a medium or a light, <coughs> disgusting. Get out of here. <laughs> Absolutely not. Because I drink it black, but the Nespresso, well, I, uh, I pour a little bit of milk in that. A little what? Milk, have a milk. Because I like lattes. Yeah. They're so good. Lattes are great. What are you talking about? Wow. I'm so jealous. They're so great. Look. Next lattes time really someone good. wants to get you a gift, really just throw it in their ear. Machine. It's really not that expensive. It's not that bad at all. I will say, at least in my opinion, I was gonna say how I'd rather have that it? than a Keurig. A Keurig is just one cup of coffee at a time. I drink way more coffee than that. A Keurig is wasteful to me. An mm -hmm. espresso, though, that's a different. It's a different thing altogether. It's not just regular coffee. It's foamy latte. Cloudy, heaven like, just bliss in your mouth. Well, it's absolutely over a hundred dollars, let me tell you. Yeah, I mean, it's not cheap, but again, if someone wants to gift you, so something, I gotta save up, pop it in their ear. Hey, hey, we got a place guys. where I can get any kind of coffee. I hate get black don't coffee, I never know what to get. I don't know how to order coffee. No, well, I've been recently adding oat milk to it. Ew, oat milk's gross. No, it's not. I do coconut milk. Yeah, it is. Why do you say that? Because it tastes coconut like milk shit. is like really thin. It's coconut like milk's great. It is very watery. I'm with you, Eric. In fact, it doesn't oat milk froth. Is, at oat all. milk is just not. I just want yeah cow's titty milk. All right. I don't, I just, I that's all I want to. That's usually what I cow take. Cow milk growing up, and it's like, it's fine. I'm not like mad about it, but it's so heavy, and it does kind of fuck me up inside a little bit. Fuck me like, up inside. Milk? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm a Are whole milk skim? motherfucker. That's Ooh. even weirder. No, I drink 2% like a normal person. Oh. That's what I grew up on, and. I don't really care for it that it's much now. Best. It's way too I much. I would it's much way, rather have whole milk. I, my, my system can eat it. Oh, what? No. Whole milk is for babies and old people only. Uh, yeah, no. I'm both of those things simultaneously. I'm a That's little baby. I am <laughs> old and too young. Well, okay. Maybe we could get a little bit of whole milk and a little bit of 2% milk. <clears throat> what do you need it for? <clears throat> Coffee? Coffee. Oh, oh you put milk well, in I guess if you're getting whole milk. Yeah, I oh, guess I don't, you I don't get any of that milk, shit. I guess I'll take that as creamer. I am. I, I, I actually. Any of it. I typically. I, I have a little bit of uh, French vanilla creamer. And I put it with my yeah, coffee. Okay, that's fine. Let's use that. Let's um, use that. But that's. That's it. Too sweet. I, uh, it's yeah. very sweet. I accidentally it is... one this weekend thinking it was a good idea, a good substitute for milk. Bad idea. It was so mm. sweet. I can't handle it. I don't so put a don't lot in. I, like my ratio, my my ratio is definitely a lot more coffee to f creamer. You know Look, what the, I mean? The so. point is, is that I take my coffee with cream, and I so I need some sort of cream, whether that be milk or half and half or coffee oat mates milk. no not oat milk i will throw it i will throw it at you okay well, here's I'm... right in your face here's the thing bring in your oat milk. milk we eric bring whatever you want but i'm gonna fly so i am i'm actually gonna request that we do a grocery run 
pretty quickly to when we get in so that oh, we can absolutely. get all of our stuff because I'm not going to fly with a bunch of fucking I mean, we'll have hours to go. We could also yeah, like we could four. also Instacart yeah. or whatever and get stuff oh, delivered. So we also have Eric's car so we don't have to walk around with groceries. Oh, that's that's true. true. So it's going to be fine. And we have a that parking is space. Correct. So we're like pretty golden. We Girls. We can do that. Well. Yeah. And we'll get all the milks you I don't want. Know we'll have a little half <laughs> we'll gallon have, of each. We'll have a taste milk, test of milks. Milk, your whole milk, your creamers, <laughs> half and half, whatever you oh, want. Oh, we're gonna need we're gonna need milk for the wings. We're gonna need milk for the wings. Oh, we're doing the wings. That's or right. I'm gonna need milk. For I don't milk. think we had teased that milk. yet, but milk. okay. Do you guys ever go to? Whatever. Did you guys ever? <laughs> <have shoes? laughs> Careful, you unleash the Hulk. Shuba's like the music venue. Yeah, yeah. yeah you, uh, you perform there. Yeah, uh, Caleb and I perform. I'm sorry, he who must not be named <laughs> and I performed there with uh, Rufus. Well, that's like that's like the neighborhood the place is in. Oh. Yo, Shuba's is dope. Yeah, that's a cool spot. Yeah. Good. I wonder if they still got a Budweiser and a shot for like five bucks. We're going to find out because we're definitely going to go there if they're still around. Probably. Looking. That was legit. I can't remember the name of the movie, but it's with John Cusack and he makes mixtapes. and High Fidelity. Yeah, Say High any. Fidelity. Say They've got oh, a anything? poster of shoes in one of the scenes. That's oh, really? That's cool. Oh. What do you know? <laughs> okay, so Cheesies is definitely on the list. Oh, we're definitely going to Cheesies. Cheesies, absolutely. If it's still there. I will fuck Harold's. somebody we're for going to cheese. Cheesies. Oh, Harold's, going to Harold's, Portillo's. Portillo's. Those are the, Portillo's. Those are the must, must I dudes. Go to, I want to go to Lou Malnati's. Yeah, deep we're going to have a nice Malnati. deep dish. Oh, that's, like, that's all our mm. dinners right there. Yeah, I and mean, lunches. we're going to... Well, Cheesy's is going to be drunk late at night. See, yeah, we might have yeah, fourth yeah, meal, yeah, 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 Eric. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. know us. Second dinner. But also... We can go to the to the right, old so Taco Cheesy's Bell and pay our Harold's. respects, since it's no longer there. <laughs> it's not there at all. That's what I'm saying. We can pay our respects to it, you know? Really kneel down and pray next to it, you know? Thank for, th- be thankful for everything it's Take given us. Yeah, you know. Lobby. <laughs> oh God. God. Um, okay. We get a little snack at Salsita, yeah. which is a giant burrito Ooh, that we all split between. You know, the five I'm of us. down with some Salsita. Okay. That it's was still there. That, it is. I know. <gasps> oh, the Arancinis from Oh yeah, po- uh, Postinos. Uh. Paninos. Paninos. Postinos. Paninos. It was Paninos. Anyway. Um, Hell yeah. We have time. Excited for it. Crisp. That would be great. Is that the Korean barbecue? It is, but crisp. It's on the. It's on the list. I am always down with Korean barbecue. Do we want to squeeze in Denny's? (laughs) (laughs) Or I. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper diner. Oh. We could do that if for brunch. We're gonna, if we're gonna do a diner, I'd like to go to the Bagel. Okay, we're I'm not sure they're still diner. there. I, I'm pretty sure they closed. Then let's go to the Bagel. I don't know what the Bagel it's is. Jewish deli. Mm. You'll, you'll love it. I love the sound of that. It used to be right by my. We house. need to go to the Jewish deli up the street here. You guys, I don't think we're gonna need to I be cooking our own food. They have. Yeah. We're yeah. just gonna yeah. we're eat like coffee and the around and there. What'd you say, Eric? Yeah. No, that's not working. I said I think they have an 11th Street Diner around there. Oh, uh, that's I know a good they spot. They definitely have one in the South Loop. Yeah. I know there's definitely one there. That's like that's... the spot, but I think they put another one up. Right by Five Guys. Should, should, we, go to, should we go to Bar Louie? God, they have one here. Yeah. Boo! Old it's times. a chain. But it's right. I'm saying the specific one that was by Two East and all of that. 
because that would be a little nostalgic, and it'd be cool to see all the college we, kids that are, are going gonna in go, there now. Are we going to walk around there? Are we I don't think walk, Toppers walk is there, there anymore. Nah, Toppers is gone. No, is Paulie still there? Oh, Toppers. What was the other? Paulie's. Paulie's. Paulie's was legit. Everybody was all about Toppers. My heart. Paulie's had my heart. Yeah. Anyway, Polly's was I mean, good. Polly's was expensive though. Polly's, three bucks. Polly's, yeah. What are you talking about? Polly's was cheap, but it was greasy as shit. But it was still so fucking good. Yeah, just so lit at so one, two in the morning. Heat lamps all day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <sighs> just the way I like it. Let's do that. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> Chicago, ready for it. Uh, we had a pretty fun weekend this what last else weekend. What do you want to do? Do you want to see the bean? I don't care. I honestly oh, could yeah? give a What'd shit. Oh, you do? Oh, um, do you guys remember Epic Burger? Do you remember when it first opened? <laughs> when it gonna... first opened? I what? do remember what? that. Oh, Epic Burger. I never went. I remember it, but I never went. That was expensive. That was like a fifteen dollar burger, and you're like, "What just happened?" <laughs> but it was good. Yeah, that was like a fifteen dollar burger back in two thousand thirteen too. Oh, Blaze Pizza! Yeah, it got I'm voted so the worst funny. pizza in America. Do you guys know that? Yikes! <laughs> oh, did it Blaze? really? That's funny. By Barstool. There, are, you guys, which is based so in Chicago. Really? How are we going to choose? There are so many places. <laughs> We're going to be stuffed to the gills. A lot of bang bangs. Yeah. Well, right. but don't worry, Here's we'll be locking we'll everything off. We'll riot, That's we'll riot true. a bunch of places out. We'll get a little fishbowl and we'll just <coughs> draw. draw places. <coughs> no, because that means somebody's a little exciting too. too east. I want to go well, smoke I mean, cigarettes and right. pretend like I'm a student. That's the most democratic way. Speaking of Columbia, uh, Jess, you're wearing the shirt yeah, right I'm now. I'm currently doing that. I don't have to pretend. I'm wearing I'm wearing my nudie. No hood. It's yeah. that's called a crew yeah. neck. This is usually um, what I travel in too. Nice. Well, I call it a nudie. That sounds anyway, bad. Uh <laughs> <laughs> oh my god i can't uh, wait for all the food we're gonna be eating oh yeah it's gonna be great oh yeah hold on let me get I might have to just wear my i yeah. just gotta wear my sweatpants just bring like 10 pairs so of sweatpants yeah. sweatpants yeah. yeah we're all gonna leave oh, chicago like, like 50 walking. pounds heavier for sure <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have, like, five chocolate cake <laughs> The The, the flight like attendant's going to be pizza? like, your baggage is actually fine, but yeah, we actually don't have room for you. Did you Did you get a second and you're like, ah. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. And so I hope that uh, we're all ready for a lot of walking and mm-hmm. a lot of eating. Mm-hmm. No. Yes to the mm-hmm. second one, no to the first one. But I'm prepared for it. The eating will help. Walking, I know. Let's get an Uber. Hey, at least Chicago's flat. You don't have to walk up a hundred fucking hills like you do here in Denver. Imagine eating a full brunch, having three mimosas, and then having to climb a hill. Mm -hmm. We've done it a lot because one of our favorite places is like a block and a half away. Just this weekend, we had to climb a fucking hill oh there. yeah i'm like oh my god yeah. just because we're in the mountains there's like many mountains yeah in the road. what so Come many on. hills in the mountains stupid <laughs> it's too much it's too much it's too guys. much uh but i will say the flatlands like nebraska way too flat yeah you gotta like, get some curves baby balance, y'all there's a balance it's good to maintain that yeah just want to make that clear Good so, uh, yeah, this weekend we went up to the mountains with some friends, partied pretty fucking hard, yeehaw. uh, did some... Our western vibes. Yeah, did some yeehawing, watched some people get pulled on skis 
by another person on a horse uh, and hitting jumps wow, and stuff like cool. that. And yeah, it was fun. It's pre- it's wild here. Like people love it. I took people some mushrooms. Eat it. Ugh. Michael was there any SSX tricky type tricks? Oh yeah. Uh, nothing too crazy, but definitely some, like, people hitting the jumps and, like, pushing, you know, doing the whole, like, half, like, turn with the skis out. Uh, I don't know what they call it, Any but, you know. snowboarding? No snow, it's not a snowboarding no, not activity. No, not for the event. Mm. It's a sport, technically. Cool. Yeah. Was it, were they big horses? Yeah, they were, they were good your size. Regular size horses. Yes, yeah, you know they were horses. Horses are generally pretty big. They were horses. <laughs> no, big old dick. no, so uh, that, just out flopping yeah. about, just like hanging down to the ground, like bragging down. You're like, is that a third ski? Oh, <laughs> it's crazy. Well, I mean, they don't the say dog. horses are hung like me for no reason. Right. Oh, right. Yeah. Right. yeah, that makes sense. Get out of here with that. Right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, on that note... Is there any medical evidence to back that up? What is, like, the dress code? Like, what are we going for when we're in Chicago? Oh, like, shit. <laughs> what, now... Are we just going to talk about Chicago every podcast now until we're in Chicago? Is that what's going to happen? Yeah, we don't have any yes, listeners. It's so exciting. This is our time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is for us. We're getting together for us, not for them. Exactly. Um, I think priority for me is going to be weather related. Yeah. Oh, that's right, so right, logical. Right, right. Priority for me is going to be probably like color coordination it's spring so i'm probably gonna wear a lot of like bright colors you know (laughs) i will probably bring the same fucking three outfits that i wear every week comfort comfort and then also (laughs) nostalgia yeah just comfort yeah like should i try to fit into the pants from 10 years ago that I already got rid of. Damn. What? I am wearing those pants today. Of They're course. They're pants now. Of course. And <sighs> that's... I'm wearing no the underpants from when fit. They're too big now, though. Yeah, when are you supposed to get rid of your underwear? Like, is there... <laughs> I'm glad you like caught that. Uh, I'm glad you brought it up. First of all, I'm definitely not uh, doing that (laughs) right now. Uh, But Uh, I would say, ideally, probably a year, two years max. Oh, we're going with years. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Years has nothing to do with it. Okay, this is strictly a usage situation. You need to Okay. You need to feel it out. Do you have holes in it? Are there holes in the crotch cuz your dog chewed it? Oh. Are they all stained up and no, skid marks? No holes per se, but like what if they're like Is the still, elastic like crunchy? They're, they're worn and <laughs> That like, Eric, you already know. They're crunchy, but not You saying that elastic it is anymore. the cheapest thing you could possibly kind of buy. Go buy new underwear. If you are questioning it, it's a I yeah. I do throw buy it new out. underwear. If you're questioning, I'm not. If I'm you're like, should I? I don't know. Is it time? The answer is always yes. She's got a good point. I reward well, myself what about with when the it's new your socks. <laughs> of course you, you do. Use, like your nice underwear. <laughs> yeah, but like. Jess, I'm a man. Underwear is just underwear. There is no such thing as nice. Now you're you right. have. He's lying. He has nice underwear. He might not know it. No, I know which underwear is <laughs> I mean, nice. Like, I've definitely got nicer <laughs> underwear than others, but like I wear, I, there isn't like yeah, a. It's not like a. Lines. Oh, we're going out tonight. I better put on. I better put on my good underwear. <laughs> like. <laughs> 
Yeah. I'm just. <laughs> 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 My sex that's because he doesn't try anymore okay <laughs> oh sad michael oh he still has the crunchy elastic man yeah Get crunchy elastic it. no i don't have in your socks elastic. too i'm like what are you michael, fucking get rid of it my my socks Shibli? i no my socks are all pretty new at this point and my underwear is too you seem like a pretty, pretty like good. old school boxer type guy nah i'm briefs Briefs oh, all day. Yeah. Briefs. Boxer or briefs? briefs. Well, boxer, boxer briefs. briefs. Like yes. Whitey tidies. No, not whitey oh, tidies. No. He has no boxer no briefs. Pair that are white. Also, uh, yeah, not a single pair Batman that I own. Whitey tidies, Michael. <laughs> yeah, no, not a They're whitey tidies. They're all tidies colorful. Guy. You'll yeah. see him. He'll he'll pop them out for. A I'll pop them out. I got some. I got some nice uh, red ones. You know, for red panty night. It's pretty cool. Yeah. You guys do rip Yeah, it's pretty great. Cassandra and I both I uh, uh, we'll match. We'll red. match. We'll just be like, hey, let's both wear red tonight. Yeah. Underneath though. Underneath though. And then of course black on top. Yeah. Really? Obviously. That's so funny. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even own a pair of red underwear. Maybe I should do do something about that. I don't know. Do you I plan guess. on showing anybody? Or maybe not. Why does it matter? <laughs> not either. really. I have a lot of floral and black. Like, just black. Oh, black, black is the best. That's most of my yeah. undergarments. Because it's yeah. slimming. What? You I'm limited like to word? just, like, solid colors. I got a bag that has, like, some... Like weird colored camo, like it's like a blue pair of so it's blue camo. Oh, that sucks! You can't find your dick. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Underwear. Huh. Underwear is funny. It is. Isn't it? I want to try that sheath. I want to try that sheath underwear. Apparently, it like holds your balls. Oh, I love those. Yeah. (laughs) I just realized how that sounded. Like it's like (laughs) got a a separate compartment to like hold your balls. Yeah, it's like a little nest for them. Have you seen the eggs in them? It's so cute. You just want to like hold them. That's I why haven't I want them tried them. Them. I've <laughs> seen the commercials like from Instagram. Sweating. I don't know. That's why I want to try. I want to try it out. Because I, so I also agree. In front of people I, I also I agree, Eric, around. that they could that like, they it's... could be sweatier. I agree with that. But I still want to try it. Like I don't know. I've I've seen them. Also, also sponsor like us. You know what I mean? Like I always hear about sponsors for pinching. Oh. Pinching seems increased risk. Okay. Eric, do you wear boxers? Oh. Boxer briefs. Oh, okay. Look at that. All right. Couple of twins. <laughs> I was just about to say that. That's so funny. Now we're twinsies. <laughs> <laughs> I have a red pair too. Twinsies. Nice. Yeah, you, you do. have a red. Okay, so now I guess we all. For Michael's have request. Yeah, yeah, I told Eric. Hey, I <laughs> yeah, got it's some. Yeah, a group thing. <laughs> sexy Saturday night. <laughs> That's right. Guess it's happening now. Whoa. In that case, I've got something. Everybody put on your best lingerie. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Bam, bam, bam. <laughs> oh, I... <sighs> that's how tired I am. <clears throat> yeah, it's yeah. Late. We partied. <clears throat> we partied a lot last weekend. Still recovering, but it was a good you time. Too old for this shit. That's- Three day that's we what did happens when you turn thirty. We did three days of like going after getting after it, you know. Get after it. Fucking bender and 
We got after it. We did. We got got. We got it. Good mm. good amount of drinking. Good amount of drugs. <sighs> All over the place, man. We did the whole gamut. Yeah. That's unbelievable. I haven't done that in a while. Yeah. Did, I'm glad you survived. That sounds like a whole lot of liver pounding. It was um, simultaneously me feeling like uh, I could definitely do this all the time. And on the other side, I was like, I need to slow down. I need to look at my <laughs> life. <laughs> this is a dirty moment. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. <clears throat> it was a good time. The mornings were a little rough. Sunday morning was pretty fucking Some rough for me. Rough. Some nights were rough, too. I had a rough night one night. Yeah, yeah you did have a rough night one night. But what? we survived. We survived. We got through. Keep on keeping on, you know. That's what you that's do. That's right. Kept the party going. Mountain Damn, right. over kind of sucks. Oh, it's the worst. Yeah. Yeah. We we learned how to ski. Oh, yeah. were your thighs burning like I told you it would? Um, less my thighs, areas. more my calves. A lot of my outside muscles, like. The outside of my thighs and my uh, calves. And like on my shins. Yeah. And then my knees. My fucking knees. Oh, yeah. It's brutal. Yeah, the knees. On my knees. Uh, but Cassandra but was, made it, it down fun. a green. She made it down a green. I didn't nice. run. She did a full run. I struggled, run. but I made it down. I stayed on bunnies because by the time I felt confident enough, my legs were shot. <laughs> Yeah, it was a lot going down that mountain. <laughs> That's I'll say that. What I would have done too. I'll say this: the bunnies. Yeah. They need an in between. Okay, you need bunnies, then next level, then the mountain. Because Hold going on. from bunnies to mountain. So what are we that calling? That is insane. Can we we got to figure out what what the in between is called? If they're they're called bunnies. The wolf. No. The fox. Oh. Okay. The fox run. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the fox run. Rabbit. I actually okay. I like that upgrade. I like that. You got the bunny run, you got the fox run, then you got just the mountain run. I I, I can get with that. Yeah. I feel like it would just be like intermediate. Well, I feel like that's what I think that's what like it's green like is supposed to mean. Eric, you know, like you can't call it what it is. You have to make up a new name for it. Yeah, it's not medium. Like yeah, it's um, beginner, but they don't call it beginner. Yeah, they call it green. Or bunny. bunny. The par hill. Par? Is that in golf? Yeah, that's golf. That's golf. Like, even. It's everything. It's a term in everything. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if that... Okay, well, I don't really know a lot about white people sports. I don't, I don't golf or ski, so. Par yeah. run Hold on. should Hold be on. the flat yes. run where you where you're taught how to move about the cabin. Jess, what's your favorite sport? Oh, hockey. Is that not I the whitest the fucking hockey. sport in the world? No, the hockey. whitest fucking sport in the world is skiing. Is skiing or or the tubing the lounge luge? And what do you call that? Ice sports, which is also hockey. How many how many uh, black <coughs> people are uh, play hockey or in the NHL right now? A few, a few, a few. There's you don't think there are a few skiers? <coughs> I bet. I bet. Black? No. I bet it's. I bet it's on par. I'll look it up. How many did you see? Nigeria has a skiing team. Is that what you're trying to tell me? No, but what I'm saying is, (laughs) yes. (laughs) Uh, But what I was saying is, 
I'm sure there's this gear from, I don't know, maybe like the UK or something like that. Uh, that is black. They don't ski in the UK, Michael. You don't think they travel there in fucking Europe? 1.5% <laughs> black people ski. Now. Huh. Out of... Yeah, out of out of ninety eight point five percent white, thirty four black hockey players in the <laughs> NHL. Thirty four, way more. There you go. Way more. I would say probably way out more. Of, what's the percentage though? Yeah, what's the percentage though? And also, like, you're helping. You're helping my argument here, Michael. No, I don't think I am. Yeah, ninety-eight and a half percent is pretty. So it says three percent of NHL There's players. There's way more black people in hockey. Are various ethnic backgrounds. So it doesn't say black specifically. So we can't really mm-hmm. say it could be even. It could be even. Three percent, one and a half. But how many? How many total players are there? By how many <clears throat> black I don't know. players? We don't know it. Hmm. So I'm saying that there are more black people that do ice hockey than there are skiers, Michael. That's what I'm saying. Skiing is a white sport. One of the top in the world right now is a black 12-year-old. What? Skier? Seriously? Yeah. Wow. Nine hundred and three. Because well, nine hundred and three professional skiers. Sports. No, nine hundred and three players in the NHL. Thirty-four. Thirty-four out of nine hundred three. What is that? Let's let's look at the math here, everybody. What was it? Thirty-four out of nine hundred. What? Nine hundred three. That's three point eight percent. That's point. Th- Zero three percent. No, it's three, three percent. No, it's not. It's three point eight percent. Three point eight, which is a higher percentage than skiers. Than the 1.5. That's true. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Well, that was a fun I'll little rabbit ask hole. Me to be on a ski trip, I will. I will not go. Jess, I, I wouldn't ask time. you to do any activity outside ever. You don't have to do anything. Oh, thank you, you, you no. Michael. Dick. Just well, say no. the reason Just why. No. The reason why is because. When we went to Washington, no. there was a three-foot step that you could have easily walked down, and you decided to walk all the way around to a different spot. It was more scenic, okay, Michael? Definitely more scenic. It wasn't. Scenic. You couldn't see shit. Well, that was it was dark Jessica. and cloudy <laughs> and rainy. Yeah, it was very rainy. It's very rainy there. <laughs> yeah. It rains a lot. Yeah. You would know. <clears throat> anyway. Well, well, fuck. What can I say? I, I'm not outdoorsy, okay? That's okay. That's why we go to Chicago. <laughs> that's exactly right. I think the pork buns are ready. The pork buns. I think. <clears throat> Did you guys watch the Mary Kate and Ashley movie with Agatha? Hold on, is this your final thought? <sighs> no. Okay. okay, it can be. It can be. Never mind, I'll save that for later. No, do it up. Well, that's a little tease for y'all, okay? You <laughs> comment below. No, nah, just you do it up. Below, let just me do know it if up. You've seen it. We'll come back to it next week.
All right. Well. <coughs> I don't know. Who's we'll up first? We'll start it off then. I, I guess, uh, I guess I'll go. Um, once again, yeah, excited about Chicago. Uh, I guess that's going to be our focal point of conversation uh, until we finally get there. So just strap in, folks. Probably going to hear a lot of the same things um, in, in the coming weeks. Uh, yeah, just keep tuning in. I don't really have anything for you this week, so... Um, all right, so I had something kind of awesome happen at work today. Ooh, dish. So, kind of started off as a shitty day. I had to open and be there at 6 a.m., but the bakers are usually there leaving when I'm coming in, and sometimes they have, like, failed experiments. They have leftovers of... That they're just like, hey, we got these extras. Fuck yeah. I'm like, yeah. Nice. I get that. Yeah. I used to work so next to the bakery at the casino. Yeah. They had a shit ton. They fucked up some brownies. But they were brownies made with Guinness. Oh, they're super chocolatey. God. Super rich. But so good. Hell yeah. <laughs> I ate so many. You got and drunk. Then, so I was the only one there when they like, well, I tried, I tried, mm. I tried real hard, but yeah, I was the only one there when the bakers revealed this information. So I ate like a, a bunch before I revealed the information to my coworkers. As I go, like, oh, by I the way, done the same. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they saw me doing it, but damn, I finally revealed truth wouldn't it cook out the alcohol there's also some like apple strudel yeah Yeah. probably but did you feel drunk but still very good flavor no yeah that's Hmm. awesome yeah it was awesome go shout some right now hell yeah i do too fuck I love brownies, chocolate. Like brownies are chunks, not the the chips, the chunks of chocolate. Oh yeah, chalk a chunk. All right, that's yeah. Jesus, well now I'm fucking hungry for chocolate. Chocolate. (sighs) Yeah, I want dark chocolate with a Guinness. (laughs) Um, GS. It's me, Jess. What's up? Um, I had something for you, but I forgot what it was because I'm thinking about Guinness. <laughs> and I'm thinking about how much I want to drink it for St. Patty's Day and how St. Patty's Day Cheers, I'll drink to that, bro. this year. Yeah, bro. Oh, I remember what it was. Okay, so, um, you know, I just didn't want you to forget to pursue life and um, liberty. No, just pursue Happiness. life. Like you don't. Yeah. No, not even that. Just life. You know, just stay alive is what I'm trying to say. And a way to do that would be to propel yourself forward in any way possible. And another way to do and that forward. is and to take a bunch of mushrooms. Woo! You could do that. You could definitely do that. Yeah, for sure. It's just, you know, you got to keep on keeping on. And, um, you know, even if you're at your dream job, but it doesn't pay you anything, you know, keep going, keep it forward, you know, do what you have to do to pursue life. So that's what I have to say. Okay. Uh, Cassandra. Cassandra. Yeah. Um, did y'all know that we're going to Chicago? Have we talked about that yet? Hey. Uh, uh, yeah. Mark the old cows, y'all. And that's calendars for you youngins. <laughs> you don't get the jargon. <laughs> um, 
But, uh, yeah, I just want to say that if you haven't experimented <laughs> in the kitchen, uh, really get on it. It's really great. <laughs> and I'm saying this, um, secondhand from Michael, because <laughs> I surely don't cook. But, uh... <laughs> We, and by we I mean he, has been experimenting with some homemade mac and cheese, and it is delightful. And, um, Max Famous Mac and Cheese. Really, it's really great. It's better than that because it ain't no shitty crap. Sorry, sorry. I know that's your go to, but it sucks. Um, so does Krispy Kreme while we're on it. Okay, all right. Um, but anyway, with that, I think we're good. Um, hit him with it. Folks, you already know what it is. Uh, smash that subscribe button, y'all. Um, hit a like. Hit a follow. Hit a share. Um, let us know your thoughts. Send us a comment. Um, send us a DM, an email. The Sundays Podcast at gmail.com or The Sundays Podcast on all your socials. Um, and folks... We love hearing from you, so keep those messages coming. Uh, you can do it! Mensajes. For those of you Spanish listeners. Um, okay, <laughs> that was rough. Folks, we will see you next week. Thanks for tuning in, as always. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs>